guys, welcome back to my channel and if you are new to my channel, welcome to my channel. I am Daniela and I hope you are having a great day. So if you can't tell by the quality, the quality is a little better or at least if the background's a little blurrier. Um, I found, I figured out that one of my lenses could do this and I'm, I'm just amazed and just... I hope you enjoy the quality, I love it, so I hope you love it too. So as you can see by the title, I'm going to be doing volleyball tips and how to make the volleyball team because I recently just tried out for the first time and I do have some tips to give you guys and I'm still kind of new to like, trying out, like I've only tried out once so I, I don't know everything, I'm not like a master at this, but these are just like the tips that I'm going to give to you guys and um, yeah, so let's just get started. So my first tip is to be positive. Volleyball is a really positive sport and it's just like just encourage your teammates and just be positive and uplifting. Don't be like, oh, you didn't make the serve. Come on, do this. Be like, oh no, it's okay, you got it. Next time you got it. So like be really encouraging. The coaches love to see that like if you have a bad attitude then of course they're not going to want you on their team because obviously who wants a bad attitude on the team i would rather have like a person who's like more happy about volleyball and not like so good than a person who is really good but has a really bad attitude because it's just not gonna be fun. Volleyball is supposed to be a fun sport and it is a fun sport if you make it fun. So just be positive, have fun, and you will, coaches will love, like to see positivity. The next tip is to just try your best. Um, don't feel too nervous about it. Um, yes, it is tryouts and it is kind of nerve-wracking, nerve, nerve I don't know if that's the word, but um, just try your best, and I know you guys can do it, you you can do it, anyone, if you have your mindset on something, you will, you will achieve it, you can do it, like don't say that you can't do it, because I know you can do it, and I used to say that to myself too, but you just have to keep trying, and I, it, it will work out. Go to open gyms, I Tryouts were yesterday, I don't know when it's gonna be, this video is gonna be posted, but it was the 15th or 16th, I don't know what today is. Um, but yeah, go to open gyms, mine started in May, find out when your open gyms are, go to the open gyms, go practice, let the coaches kind of see what you can do and get to know them a little better, let them get to know you, and by the time you're at tryouts, you'll have like your friends that you like talk to at open gym, you'll know the coach a little better, it's not like you're just like first meeting them, it's not like you're going to be with strangers, you're going to be a little more comfortable, and yeah, I definitely recommend going to open gyms, I went to like five open gyms I think. Um, I wanted to go more, but I was just too busy, but um, I definitely recommend going to open gyms. They're really fun, and you get to build your skill. The coaches get to help you a little bit, and um, you get to see what they want for, like, tryouts, or kind of, like, what they want on their team, and they'll give you, like, advice and stuff like that, and it's just, it's, it's good. I recommend not like expecting to be on a certain team. Like don't expect to be on varsity your freshman year. Don't expect to be like on a just I don't know how to explain. Don't expect because I recently just heard this like saying from someone and she said expectations are premeditated resentments. So don't expect things. Just have your goal set. Set your goal to be like on a certain team, but don't expect to be on that team because you will be disappointed in the end if you don't make it on that team. <clears throat> My voice is like being really weird right now. I think I'm starting to get sick, which is not good now. Communication. Communication is so, so, so important in volleyball. Make sure to communicate and talk with your teammates. Not like talk about like the latest gossip. No, not like that. Like talk like ball or short short or something like that make sure to talk because sorry my card went full but coaches like to see communication they like to see that you get can work with your teammates and like help them because communicating and like maybe like if the ball's about to hit someone's head you need to tell them that the ball's about to hit their head like it's really self-explanatory just communicate with your teammates it's really important so if you don't make the team just Keep trying, keep practicing, you can always try again next season. Don't be discouraged. You might be a little upset, which I understand if you don't make it. 
but just keep trying, just keep practicing, be better than you were. If you really want to be on the volleyball team, you will really work hard for it because if you just like mope around and just wait for someone to see you, it's probably not going to happen. You, it's your life. You, you, you work for the things that you want. You can't just get everything the easy way because that's just not the way it works. My last tip is to just have fun. Volleyball is a really fun sport. Just have fun, make new friends. Sports are a really good way to make new friends if you're going to a new school or you're going to be a freshman. And just, just have fun. I absolutely love volleyball. It's a great sport. And I hope you guys will have fun also if you try it for volleyball or any sport. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, please make sure to give it a huge thumbs up. Don't forget to subscribe. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye! By the way, I'm sorry. I haven't posted any back to school videos. I... I'm really lazy. Yes, it's my vibe.